praise him. And that's what David said. You're my rock. Because right now, I have nothing solid to stand on. So you're my rock. You're my fortress. Because right now, I have no castle. Uh, Solomon, I mean Samuel, Saul is after me. He's trying to kill me. I'm in a cave. Don't have any fortification. Don't have any protection. So you're my fortress. So you got to praise him while you're going through. I say this all the time. Oh, but but if we, if we just do it and we'll see such magnificent results if we'll just apply the word of God. Say, I know it. I'm thinking I'm, I'm getting it. 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 Second Corinthians 2 and 14 say, when we triumph in Christ, it diffuses the fragrance of his knowledge every place. See, when you when you get triumph, when you get victory by waiting on God, when you get victory by not lying or stealing or fornicating, when you get victory by doing the God thing, it diffuses the fragrance of his knowledge in every place. People need to see the saints do it God's way because the eyes and our own natural orientation usually will respond to troubles and situations the way the flesh would do it or the way our peers would do it or the way our parents did it or the way the world do it but what does God say do and when we do it the way God says do it it diffuses the fragrance of his knowledge everywhere see we want people to see the, the glory of God Oh, but they'll never see the glory of God until the people of God start expecting to see greater out of the worst uh, that's why he said in Jeremiah 28 he said I come to give you an expected end we got to start doing things intentional uh, we need to start praising him intentionally on purpose not because we feel like it but I'm praising him because I know it's going to release triumph in this situation so I'm doing it with a purpose and an expected end I don't come to church just to sit down and hear a preacher preach me happy but I'm coming and hoping that I hear a word because faith come by hearing the word he sent his word and it healed them the word is a light to my feet and a lamp to my pathway that word have I hidden in my heart that I might not sin against God I need the word it's the sword of the spirit which is the word of God and is able to devour every enemy that come thy way I want a word are you getting a word Hallelujah, I got to close, I got to close, I got to 